should probably take care of the spellcaster. Because, um... Hold on. Let's move him very last to see what we're doing. It's like playing XCOM. Uh, you should really see what you're up against. Oh, who am I gonna put at the front? Ah, this is kind of bad. I really should actually take these guys and help, but I've already committed. Um... Alright, we will trade... We will go into the convoy to get the... Uh, key. I was gonna... Um... I need all of these. <laughs> Alright, and... Send him in. Rally. Just stand next to him. Hopefully. Oh man, I was about to explain my master plan. I, I just completely lost it though. Must not have been that great of a plan. Oh man. There is a beating awaiting anybody to walk into that room. Are you serious? You can't kill? Ah. And I'll be left in serious condition. Nice, nice. And you did dodge, so I guess you're okay. I don't want you at the front of it, though, because then you can get attacked by one, two, three, four people. And you can only take about two hits. Okay. Hopefully you got higher avoidance. What is your avoidance? 55, 45, 40. 55, 62. All right! You're taking the lead! And keep your loving sword. Yeah, we need you to have your loving sword because it's really good at it's. You're gonna get attacked by archers this turn. Oh man, and I might die. I could send in Seri, and she'd be more likely to die. Ah, Rick. Yellow. Oh, Rick. And I guess those people can attack people who aren't Donald. It'll be... No. They can do it. They can go ahead and do it. That means they all get... The other people will get some experience. Donald doesn't need to kill everyone. He's just convenient just in case you want to kill everyone. He's not a necessity though. Okay. I can actually have Chet get attacked a few times. I think by them attacking Chet, they just saved uh, Anna's life. A, they, they wouldn't have been able to kill Chet. They could have hurt him. And, yeah, now, sweet, I think. Okay, 1% chance, that's a good dodge. That's, that's pretty good. I wasn't 100% sure she was going to make it. I, there, there was a chance she could have gotten hit. But she's done pretty good on the dodging so far. All right. Okay, sweet, Anna gets to live. He's only at the beginning of the turn. That wasn't going to be the fact. I would have believed you, but it looks like what it is. It looks like we didn't take any damage, actually. Chad got attacked, he dodged, and it avoided both of her hits. I mean, the first one was pretty much a shoo-in of her getting hit. I mean, there was a 1% chance of that happening, but... But, you know, all in all, pretty solid. And I just realized we're about a few minutes into the Let's Play, and I haven't said the human game in Let's Play yet. Let's Play. We're playing. You know, as you can see, everything's going to the plan. Actually, better the plan, because the plan was that Anna was going to get bombarded and murdered. Oh, no. What is this roughing thing he's doing? I cannot have him get to that chest before me. Or at least get to that chest and then run out. That chest has boots in it. Boots are probably the best item in the game. Alright. So, I actually don't need anybody to do any healing right now. So... I'll have you... Kill this guy. Alright, he kills... She kills this guy. I mean, there's still that chance she can get hit. 1% chance. Okay, I forgot. He's gonna die. So he won't even be able to attack, so... I took the risk of the 1%. 
Didn't even have to take it, because, you know, he's dead before the turn ends. Now, we go ahead and we will send uh, me in. I think I'm going to straight up take this hit so that uh, we've seen I can kill the archer and we can get relationship points. Ah, I should have had her do it first. Then there might be a chance of her helping. Turns out Anna is... Oh, violence is on sale today. 80% chance... Okay. I've already failed this level once today. Does it get easier now? They're like, oh, Chet sucks at this game. Let's completely warp the uh, percentage chances of having... Like, see, I had a 20% chance of dodging. I dodged. We had a 40% chance of the critical happening. I critted. I mean, really, I shouldn't be criticizing it. Like, like it's actually really good. Like, oh, boy. Um, ah. All right. Making stupid decisions. I shouldn't. No one should die. I mean, everyone's HP is full, so it's no big deal. It's just like whatever. All right. Now here, this actually was part of the plan. I used them to plug up the holes. Is this an unnecessary risk? No, he might die. I just wanted to get some experience. That's why I share share and Gaius died last round. Just because I'm like, oh, I feel unsafe. Let's get some extra experience. And I really don't need to heal anyone. I guess I could should heal Chrome. Could, should heal Chrome. Ah, but I don't know what the actual hit rates are. Is Noe actually in danger? Once this guy's dead, is she still gonna be purple? Right. I'm gonna probably freak out a little if she does. And okay, she's not even close to being purple. That means we can move up and... Hold on. I want my psychic back. Oh, a mend. Nice. Maybe I should take that. Alright, now we use the mend. And heal you back up to full. Everything's going fine. It's a good, solid plan with lots of gameplay. Alright, so they'll attack. They'll attack Chet. I knew that was going to happen. It should hit. And they do. Okay. Oh, 22 damage. Oh my gosh. Is the other sword guy gonna come in and just kill me? This guy's I made one slight miscalculation. Come on, don't kill Chet. Don't kill Chet. Yo. Someone else. Not Chet. Okay, please, dodge. Come on. Actually, I can get hit. I'm at 1 HP. That. I have received my lesson. I, I have learned well. What happens? All right, we gotta get to that thief. Mm -hmm. Sir Crom, I hear movement from the floor below. It may be reinforcements. Be wary. All right. Beware. Beware. Be a very wary bear. All right. So, I think this room is going to start being swarmed with enemies, but they'll have to go through the two strongest people ever. Hopefully none of them are magic casters, but all in all, it is a pretty solid plan. Alrighty, let's move forward. Uh, yeah, that's good. I actually kind of want to be wary with her. Okay, so... her up move him up and use her to kill all right and then anna will heal me oh, yeah. i don't know which stairs produce people though they might all do it which would suck all righty i'd really rather have her run up to that thief but unfortunately I kind of have to heal Chet, because Chet is in critical condition. And Sayri, okay, Sayri can't plug up the hole, but she can move for pretty far forward. So all in all, I'm pretty sure that's all I can do. I don't know if this is going to produce an enemy, so I don't want to move her too far up. All right, let's see what happens. There was the rustling beneath the floor, nothing happened. Really? 
nothing? Really, I'm gonna shoot him myself forward. All right. You break off from the main group now. You two definitely come over here. Can Sayri and Anna handle all this? Probably not, but I need them to get the... Can I send Chet with it? I think I need Chet for Pharos. Alright. Uh, despite my better judgment, I'm sending these two in alone. Fortunately, they'll be able to heal themselves just fine, but... Oh, whatever. Probably I'll attack her. A little hurt. I don't mean that like a metaphor. Like, literally, my HP isn't perfect. And you come up with standby. And, alright, I think that's all for the turn. Let's see if any enemies storm up. Alright, you're attacking. And it's probably gonna be a miss, because it's an axe. Yes, it was. Now you cut them to ribbons. After this turn, I think we will end the part, and... I don't know, we're really close. We get, ah, that'll probably be reinforcements, and getting into Pharos with all of her bodyguards isn't gonna be a thing. Isn't gonna be an easy thing. 